Assalamu alaikum and good day everyone. My name is Sanaya D. Gimba from Mindanao State University, main campus, Marawa City, Philippines. Together with my co-researcher, Jehan Abdul Malik and Nisan Usman, we would like to present to you our research paper entitled Social Responsibility Performance of the Selected Business Enterprises in Marawa City, Challenges and Strategies. To give you a brief background of the study, social responsibility is an ethical framework in which an individual is obligated to work and cooperate with other individuals and organizations for the benefit of the community that will inherit the world that individual lives behind. Social responsibility in business pertains to people and organizations behaving and conducting business ethically and with sensitivity towards social, cultural, economic, and environmental issues. Striving for social responsibility helps individuals, organizations, and governments to have a positive impact on development, business, and society. Social responsibility is not just a word that is taught in schools. It is also something that needs to be done and measured. Social responsibility is a way of doing business that focuses on economic, legal, ethical, and philanthropic responsibilities. This idea includes both old and new patterns of understanding of business. Businesses of all sizes, including sole proprietorship, partnerships and big corporations must be responsible and work to improve the relationships with customers, employees, and the community at large. The term social responsibility in business refers to a company's management duties to safeguard the interests of society. According to the idea of social responsibility, managers' goals while making business choices should include serving and defending the interests of other members of society, such as the employees, the customers, and the community at large, in addition to maximizing profits or shareholder value. Known to be a city where many establishments and small businesses operate, Marawi City has its social responsibility besides maximizing shareholder value. It operates in a way that benefits society and adopts policies that promote the well-being of society and the environment. Businesses in Marawi City find it hard to take care of their social responsibilities because they have to try to meet the needs of their shareholders, employees, customers, and the communities in which they work. This is especially true where many businesses are new to the social responsibility field but have not yet built up the internal and external resources they need to meet the challenges and come up with the right strategies. The objective of this study was to study the status of the selected successful business enterprises, specifically gasoline stations, pharmacies, coffee or cake shops, merchandising, and furniture uh, in Marau City. It is the objective of the study to describe the business profile of the respondents in terms of their number of years in operation, type of business, number of employees, and type of ownership. To evaluate also the social, social responsibility performed by the selected business enterprises in Marawa City, to identify the challenges encountered by the business enterprises in performing social responsibility, and to determine the strategies adopted by the business enterprises in performing their social responsibility. This study was anchored on the theory of Carroll's 4 CSR pyramid. The pyramid's objective was to highlight the definitional aspects of CSR as well as the four-part framework's building block nature. With economic responsibility as the core requirement in business, sustained profitability must be strong to support society's other expectations of businesses, just as the foundations of a building must be solid to support the complete structure, the objective is that CSR infrastructure is built on the foundation of a financially healthy and long-term 
enterprise. Corporate social responsibility includes economic, legal, ethical, and discretionary expectations that society has of corporations. This set of four obligations serves as a basis or infrastructure for defining and framing the nature of a company's responsibilities to the society in which it operates. The social responsibility of a corporate enterprise is classified as follows. Environmental activities. These are the concept that businesses should act in an ecologically responsible manner. It is one of the most often practiced kinds of social responsibility. Such programs are referred to by some corporations as environmental stewardship. Then we have internal working ethics. This is to ensure that a business operates in a moral and ethical manner. It is all about the stakeholders, including leadership, investors, and workers, being treated fairly by organizations that embrace ethical responsibility. Most societies believe laws are necessary but insufficient. Society expects businesses to operate ethically beyond what laws and regulations require. Taking on ethical responsibilities means organizations will adopt activities, norms, standards, and practices that are anticipated but not legislated. Businesses are expected to follow the law spirit, not just its text. Businesses are expected to be fair and impartial even when regulations don't provide guidelines or compel actions. Then we have honest marketing. As the name implies, it is when a company advertises its products or services in a straightforward and true manner to the public. And it's the most honest and occasionally amusing method to promote more precise information on the goods and services it sells to the general market. Also included is explicit pricing information as well as the service promises. This pertains to legal duties and can also be an ethical responsibility of corporate social responsibility. Because doing business should be honest in all aspects of the business, since customers have legal rights to use safe products, to be informed about products, to choose what to buy, and to be heard. Then we have engaging in charity. Business enterprise in showing generous, generosity to society by donating or volunteering to those in need or giving some promos during times of crisis in the community and promoting public relations with the business. Corporate philanthropy encompasses all forms of business charity, voluntary or discretionary initiatives are included in corporate philanthropy. Although philanthropy is not a legal obligation, but still, it is anticipated by both businesses and the general public. For the design and methodology, this study made use of a descriptive design, and this was conducted at Marawi City, Lano del Sur, Philippines, with 63 selected business enterprises in Marawi City as respondents. The research made use of a researcher-made survey questionnaire, and it used statistical treatments such as frequency, percentage, and weighted mean. For the results and discussion, it revealed that 34 or 54% of the businesses affirm their operation duration to be between one to five years. Majority of the businesses, 23 or 36.5% are cafes or coffee shops. And about 26 or 41.3% of the businesses have at least one to five employees. Majority of the businesses in Marawa City are sole proprietorships.
On environmental activities, majority of the businesses surveyed in Marawa City are actively engaged in environmental activities. Specifically, they focus on solid waste management, the use of reusable and eco-friendly materials, energy conservation, and providing parking spaces for their customers. The respondents frequently reported implementing these practices as evidenced by their frequent often responses. In terms of internal working ethics, based on the study results, it is evident that majority of the respondents in the study exhibited a strong commitment to internal working ethics and prioritizes fulfilling their social responsibilities. On honest marketing, the findings suggest that the majority of the surveyed business enterprises in Marawi City are actively engaging in honest marketing practices as part of their social responsibility effort. On engaging in charity, the results indicate that a majority of the business enterprises in Marawi City often participate in charitable activities as part of their social responsibility effort. With regards to challenges encountered, business enterprises in Marawi City relatively encounters few challenges when it comes to fulfilling their social responsibilities. And as to the strategies adopted, majority of the respondents employ various strategies to fulfill their social responsibilities. And this is evident from their responses average weighted mean of 3.27 indicating that they consistently utilize different strategies to overcome potential challenges. In conclusion, business enterprises in Marawi City are fulfilling their social responsibility towards their customers, their employees, and the environment. Such social responsibility activities include keeping their businesses area sanitized, paying their employees fairly, practicing honest marketing of goods and services, and engaging in charitable works. Business enterprises rarely encounter challenges or issues such as lack of supply due to uncertainty and difficulty in managing and providing benefits to employees. Lastly, when it comes to business strategies, the majority of respondents are implementing strategies that help their business grow and make more profit, such as ensuring that customers are satisfied with the product or services they provide. For the recommendations, environmental activities should be encouraged. Different businesses in Marawi City should undertake a program of actions to reduce its impact on the planet's ecosystem and increase its environmental sustainability. Recycling and waste reduction should be strictly imposed by the local government unit of Marawi City. Different businesses in Marawi City should promote internal working ethics to ensure that a business operates in a moral and ethical manner. Owners of the different businesses should impose fair treatment to their employees and should embrace ethical responsibility. Honest marketing should also be encouraged because being honest in all aspects could bring a positive outcome in the business. Information about the products should be conveyed to the customers. Different businesses in Marawi City should engage in charitable activities such as giving donations or volunteering to a cause they support. Adhere to policies that promote well-being of the society and the environment while lessening negative impacts on them. Promote equality, diversity, and inclusion in the workplace and ensure ethical business decision making. These are the references used in the study. That ends my presentation. Thank you very much and God bless.